Last year, which was my first uh, year of farming, we had the worst drought in 70 years. And I was trying to establish some pasture and it didn't turn out so well. So um, I maybe have to do it uh, again this year. From that grass, I was gonna make hay for the winter. I have nothing. The whole country has a shortage of uh, food. Uh, and people are um, killing their animals. They don't, uh, they can't afford to, uh, to keep them. And they will get their hands on some feed and they have to pay like uh, 10 times the cost of uh, the usual price. So what I did was uh, I imported some, um, some hay from the guy I bought the buffaloes from in Sweden. Uh, and to pay for that feed, to keep the animals alive uh, the whole winter, I've decided to, um, to kill off the, the bulls. To pull this off, I have to rely on uh, insemination uh, from now on. To import uh, semen from, uh, from Italy, since I won't have uh, my breeding bull any longer. Uh, the problem is though, since this is a new breed to the country, none of the slaughterhouses will take them. And I think it's just uh, because it's unknown. They have no experience with it and um, instead of opening up and uh, saying yep so uh, they just uh, turn us down so, uh, <laughs> right now i don't i don't know what to do So let, let's break it down. I have water buffaloes for milk. I'm gonna milk them and hopefully I'm gonna make cheese from that milk. In order to get the milk from the animals, uh, they need to have a calf. Uh, they need a baby to start producing milk. That's just the way it is. There's a lot of people asking me, oh, when are you gonna start making the cheese? Well, I need some milk first. Why don't you just start milking? I just can't turn on the knob and, uh, and make the milk come out. And when you get a calf, uh, you either get a girl or you get a boy. The girl will be a part of the farm, uh, going into milking production um, when she's old enough. And the boys, if they don't get picked to, to be a breeding bull, they, uh, they, get, they get eaten. If this operation is gonna survive the winter, I need to, uh, I need the meat from the boys to pay for the feed uh, to the girls. My job as a farmer, I think, is to make these animals uh, thrive and have, uh, and have a good life um, and make this the best I can for them um, so that they only will only have one uh, bad day and that's the last one. And also that the last one gets as uh, good and stress-free as, as it can. Now what's happened is that someone tipped me about a small new uh, slaughterhouse uh, two hours away from here and he's accepted us so uh, we're gonna go there with the bulls. Now the nice thing about this is uh, I can trans transport the animals myself uh, rather than uh, if one of the bigger slaughterhouses were coming to get them. A car would uh, show up and uh, pick them up and, and go and drive them away and uh, and that's the last I see of them. Doing it like this, I can be the one, uh, I can stand beside them when, uh, when they die. Mm -hmm. 